Hello, everyone, with your, uh, Asian nest. Today, I'm gonna be teaching you how to play the other Asian dude, not the, not the other one, but the, the other one. So, Asians. I love Asians. So, the Asian we're gonna be playing is Kong Lao. Now, Kung Lao is the the brother of uh, Liu Kang. Kung Lao is not actually the brother. I don't know who he is, but he's like a friend. Kind of like what, what Logan Paul is to like KSI, you know? They're like, they're brothers, but they're not, you know what I mean? I'm gonna teach you how to play this character, and it is significantly harder than any other character. You know, with a lot of characters in Mortal Kombat, it's kind of just like, it's not a very hard time learning combos. You kind of just figure out the couple combos you want to do, and then that's about it. Or then you have characters like, you know, like Liu Kang, where you don't really have combos, but you just kind of, you just kind of are, you know, you just kind of sit there and do fuck all. But Kung Lao is where all of these play styles come together. Kung Lao, you can do pretty much everything. You can do combos, you can do stupid shit like grabs, you can annoy your friends with this character. What is the best way to beat people with Kung Lao? Well, best way to beat people with Kung Lao is through throws. You gotta figure out when people usually, on average, would keep blocking. So let's say I'm hitting this guy, right? I'm hitting him, hitting with two these two the most amount of time that i've played this game people keep blocking is after you do a low when you do this people usually keep blocking after that because they don't want to get hit by it again so you do it once and then you walk forward and you grab their ass fuck, 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 fuck. yep always when you do always when you do down four they always do the same thing they keep blocking for some reason because they're waiting for you to do another one it's almost like when you play this game, it becomes a reflex. Another way to annoy your opponents with Kung Lao, and this is probably my favorite one, is the airborne technique. Kung Lao has this really cool ability where you press in the air, you press down three, and this actually does pretty good damage. Now, the way you can annoy your players with this is that you jump away, and then mid-air, you're like, Nah, bro. I'm such a goofy little boy. I like jumping around. Hey, goofy motherfucker. When it comes to combos with Kung Lao, they are, uh, I would say, probably one of the most complicated combos, again, in the game. You see, Kung Lao has a lot of button presses. presses. I mean, look at these fucking com- Look at this! Now, Kung Lao has a couple ways of doing combos. The first one would be, is through your spin move. Now, your spin move is not the only one. Now, the one- The variation I'm using of Kung Lao right now is leading edge. It gives me a hat that just goes around me. But what it also does is when it hits an enemy, it stuns them for like a millisecond. Now, that millisecond might not seem significant, but you can actually use it to do combos. And then you can, you know, do all kinds of shit with this. Like that. 22 hits. That's pretty zesty, if you ask me. What's going on with my with my ropes? Kung Lao also has a lot of crushing blows, and by a lot, I mean like one. It does this kind of spinning move, which allows you to do combos even further. Again, Liu Liu, uh, what the fuck was this? Kung Lao. Kung Lao is one of those characters. Again, you know, he's came from the same balls as his brother. Does not have an overhead. Oh no, what am I supposed to do? When your opponent becomes a bitch, right, and starts just blocking, it's like, ha ha, you can't hit me, man, because I am blocking low, and you can't do overheads, which means I am safe. What you do is you grab them by their fucking face, and you hit them until they can't fucking breathe. I lied, by the way. He has one overhead, okay? One overhead. Ooh. I would recommend just grabbing them. Just grabbing them. Because that's a lot more fun, and they get mad at you. You can win matches with this combo. This is a great combo, by the way. You know, when you just play better than someone else, you know, you know when you play just so much better? 
Now another way to play the game is by pretty much playing Kung Lao and acting like no one knows what you're doing because let's be honest a lot of people do not still realize that after this there's still hits to be done. I don't know what it is about players. They think that this combo ends right there. Right here. That's where it ends. Now they can start hitting you. So they take their block off. But they don't understand that there's actually more to it. So if you ever do this move in game. Go in with full expectations that they're probably going to stop blocking midway through this. Now I have never done this before. But I'm going to give you a live demonstration on how to play Kung Lao in competitive. GG bro, you're actually a good player. I don't, I didn't check his name, but who, whatever that guy's name is, GG, you're a good player. You're actually a good player. You've got, you've, you game mechanic. I'm just, I'm the better player, but you're actually a good player. Okay, you're playing the game like it's supposed to be fucking played. Dude, Mortal Kombat is slowly becoming a game that I just, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like the way this game plays anymore. Nowadays, you just play like a bitch the entire game. It's so fucking boring. And I know the game has a breakaway, which, okay, that would give meaning to do combos, right? There's a reason why they have a breakaway in the game, and that's because combos are something you should keep doing so that the breakaway should be, you know, there's a fucking reason why there's a breakaway. It's for combos. But because there's no reason to do combos, why would there be a reason to be a breakaway? I wish this game had like in-game chat that I could just be like, yo, dude, awesome combo, bro. Holy shit. Eight hit combo? Yo! Actual insane. You're so good at the game, bro. Can he teach me? You're gonna teleport? I can read you like a fucking book. I hate, I, I swear to God, I hate these fucking unoriginal what is the point of amplifying that if you're not even gonna- What is the point of doing an amplified hellport when you don't even combo from it? What is the point of it? You do less damage. Are you a fucking idiot? I, I genuinely- I genuinely- I've lost hope on the Mortal Kombat player community. I fucking lost hope on them. I just- I don't understand how fucking bad do you have to be in a video game. How bad do you have to be in a video game so that you play like these motherfuckers do? Oh, that's a- that's not a crushing blow. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Dude, this guy plays exactly like I do, except I'm just better. That's funny.